Time will tell. And guess where you can find out? Right here on ESPN Plus, because you can see every single Bundesliga game every weekend, and you can see how this will play out as well. The race right now. Bayern running away with it so far. In fact, they are well on their way to securing their 10th consecutive Bundesliga title and the last nine barely even being close. We'll get to that in a moment, but first, the new Bundesliga boss is open to the idea of playoffs to decide a winner. She says, of course, the Bundesliga would be more attractive if there were more competition at the top, and for me, there are no sacred cows. If playoffs can help us, then let's talk about playoffs. Oliver Kahn had this to say about the situation in the Champions League from 2024. There will be a new format that we're confident about. A playoff format with semi-finals and a final would mean excitement for Bundesliga fans. Therefore, it makes sense to kick around a thought like that. We at Bayern are always open to new ideas. Rudy Voller had this to say. Uh, by Leverkusen Sporting Director right now and says playoffs are completely the wrong approach. I'm absolutely against it. Well, 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 I'm sure there are a few sides in favour of it. Interesting to see Oliver Kahn saying that on Bayern's behalf. What do you make of it all, Shaka? Um, I'm, I'm not at all in favour of, of, of playoffs, Sydney, uh, at this level. I love playoffs uh, at, the, at the bottom of the table. We're talking relegation and teams in, in, in the bottom three positions against teams uh, in, in the top three positions in the league below. But as far as I, 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 the winning the, the top league goes, um, I, I am not at all in favour. If something isn't broke, don't try to fix it. I'm not sure why people are trying to force this um, issue in, in the way that they are. But it's broken. I mean, we're saying, is it? Yeah, is it broken? Because we mentioned they are well on their way, Bayern, right now to their tenth consecutive Bundesliga Ex title. And when I say it's not even close, just look at the points gap here. <laughs> Only in the 2018-19 yeah. season do you see that the points gap was very close, was two points. Other than that, all those other years are double-digit figures. So you can see why something like this has been brought up, and you can see why some people may be in favour of it, Jan. Yes, and it's quite interesting because I'm with Shaka. I don't like playoffs uh, taking the championship. But what is interesting in Germany, the big football nation of Germany now looks like Scotland or Romania with Steyr Bucharesti or some other countries. And in no disrespect to Scotland, but this shouldn't be like this with all the great teams in Germany. So it's broken. Let's start there. And this is the new, the new uh, woman who is in charge of the Bundesliga. She started, it was a very good interview. She had new ideas, she was throwing, in, throwing them out. But what is interesting in Germany, so here is Bayern winning the league every year. And Oliver Kahn said, yeah, let's talk about that. We'll see, we'll find some new ideas. And then is Rudi Foller representing Leverkusen. The last time they won a, a, a championship, that was never. So the only chance they have to get closer to Bayern is through a playoff, but he's 100% against it. You can say that is good or you can say that is bad. What I, I think is most in, more interesting in Germany is that they have to talk about this 50 plus one rule that they say the fans are in charge because they are coming behind international teams all the time in terms of money. They're very proud of that rule, but still, I, I'm with I'm, I'm with Oliver Kahn. You you have to talk because. You have to do something, but, but I don't like the playoff idea. It should be the league champion should be the best the, over of the 34 games. Don? C can My I just say, it, it's, it's, it's the it's most broken. ridiculous it, thing. We, we can't most just... ridiculous thing ever. Hang on, hang on, right, hang on. Right, hang on. Sorry, Don, I came to you, but I'm just going to let Shaka reply to that because it sounds like you wanted to reply to that, Shaka. Yeah, so, sorry, sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off, Don. I, I was just saying... It, it, we can't just sit here and say it's broken because Bayern are, are, are better than everybody else. I, I think there are other ways to address that, that um, imbalance in, in, in German football um, without having to, to resort to, to, um, to, to, to go into playoffs. Talk about the distribution of, of, of TV revenues. Talk about capping commercial revenues. There are a number of ways that you can, you can address that and, and make the competition uh, more equal, if that's what, if that's what, you, what you're trying to do. Be, uh, other than that, or, or unless, all you're really trying to do is not address the imbalance, not make other teams better, just give them the opportunity to win the league by being better than Bayern on one or two days.
Yeah, but, but what I meant with broken is that I like that uh, uh, the new girl in town, the new sheriff in town, discussed Donata the Hopfen. ideas. Yeah, uh, Donata Hoffman, and he, she's she's coming into a after a very successful Christian Seifert, and she she said because it's not only about the league championship. This is this is a problem with the brand Bundesliga, and I agree there are hundred different or have fifty different things that it could be done, but this is problem because. It's not interesting for, for foreign countries to, to watch the Bundesliga if you always end up with Bayern. You may say that Manchester City won it over the years, but you still there is a competition to win it. And it's nothing to do with Bayern. Bayern can't be, be, be uh, slowing down. It must be the other teams make it quicker, make more speed, go more into this uh, kind of thing. But, but, but a playoff, no, don't like it. That is, that is ice hockey for me. Don? Oh my day! It's the it's the most ridiculous idea I've <laughs> ever heard in my life. Oh, let's try and give Bayern some competition. Oh, let's try and have a playoff just so someone else can try and fit Bayern to a title. Here's an idea: if you're Leipzig or you're Borussia Dortmund, stop selling your players to Bayern Munich. Stop selling them. You're only making Bayern Munich stronger every single season. Don't sell them your best players. When was the last time you seen Liverpool? sell some of their players to Man United or Man United players to Liverpool. Raheem Sterling's only the, the player I can think of at the top of my head that's left Liverpool to strengthen Man City. Apart from that, it doesn't happen. It's the most I, ridiculous not, idea I've ever heard. And not only that, I mean, the only thing that can stop Bayern, we've seen that over the years, is if they appoint the wrong coach. That can kill them off. That, that can slow them players. down. Stop selling exactly, players, but, but listen... Now, but yeah, but even worse, RB Leipzig were second in the league and then let them have Julian Nagelsmann. Exactly. I mean, and he's Yeah, exactly. It's ridiculous. Exactly. This, this is actually the, a good topic for this show because we've been talking about football, football heart, whatever you want to call it. And this is so wrong from a football standpoint of view. I, I can't obviously speak for the rest of the boys, but... The, the, the players I know, they want the best side over the season to be the champions. They don't want a team who are clearly not as good as another team lifting a trophy at the end of the year. That's not football. That's not the football heart. It's not football the way we know it. I mean, they have a, an MLS. And last year, New England Revolution were miles ahead of everybody else, but will get no recognition at all because they got beat in the playoffs. Took a couple of years earlier, is, is, it was LA. Is this what LA. it was all boiling down to? That it's, the revs got wrong. robbed? Is that what you're trying to say? It's wrong. It goes against the whole thing. And when we start playing, we want to play for the best team. And we want to win. And everybody knows that the most prestigious thing is winning the league. That's the most prestigious thing. And if you take that away, you're ripping the heart out of a lot, a lot of fans and players. Well, right now, there is no playoff system in the Bundesliga and you can continue to watch it here on ESPN Plus every weekend, including this weekend. It all gets underway tomorrow, the latest round with Leipzig taking on Cologne. Thank you very much for watching ESPN FC on YouTube. For more highlights, analysis and exclusive content, be sure to subscribe.